Hello, my name is Nick Teberger. I'm the director of the Pacific and Regional Archive for Digital Sources in Endangered Cultures, which is a project in Australia uh, called Paradisec. Paradisec was set up in 2003. We've been running for 18 years, and the project is to record and keep as many recordings as we can of the many languages there are in the world. Uh, we were set up to look after tapes made by academic researchers, linguists, musicologists and anthropologists who made these recordings since the 1950s. And obviously there's an urgent need to digitise them because we know that these tapes are in danger of uh, falling apart. But we were also very concerned that the tapes sitting in somebody's office were not connecting back to the communities that they came from. So we absolutely wanted to get those uh, recordings back and we had to find the tapes and digitise them. At the moment, we have about 13,000 hours of uh, audio in the collection, uh, 1,300 hours of video, and about 1,252 languages are represented. Research data storage uh, in Paradisic is done with appropriate licences. You can see there uh, an image of where all of the items in the collection come from and there's quite a concentration on the Pacific and Papua New Guinea. We know that the people living in these small locations have a lot of difficulty getting access to materials uh, but if we can put them into global catalogues and into Google then we're making it easier for them to find these items. We're currently using a normal kind of database, Ruby on Rails with SQL, but we want to move to uh, Oxford Common File Layout and uh, RO Crate to make this a more sustainable data set. And when we do that, we can also write microservices that deal with ingestion, conversion, and visualizing the material. And we can put those microservices onto other devices, including a Raspberry Pi, which we've tested. And you can see somebody there looking at their mobile phone, uh, testing the, um, getting access to materials in their collection, in their items, uh, in our collections. So we're very keen to keep going with Paradisic. Uh, we want, we see the future is very bright for digital materials getting back to source communities in the most remote parts of the world, but only if we structure the data properly in the first place. Thanks.